Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. In the last episode, we entered the sweet spot and traveled through the still world to reach the Pharaon Temple. Today we are going to continue through this Labyrinthian Labyrinth. Are you kidding me? That was an entrance. What the heck is going on with this temple? I have been finding that Misery Mire or Pharaon Temple has Misery Mire vibes when it comes to the temple. More passages to explore. Lots of twists and turns. This one is going to want me to spawn in the statue. The Armoses. Right there. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to pretend to understand how that's different. Oh boy. Uh, fire, 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 fire. When did I learn the fire wizard robe? Right there. Okay. Are they gonna drop something? Is that why they're on fire? No. It's, wow, already another warp point. Somewhere here must be here. And there. Put you. Okay. He chose to attack the same one. Okay, let's check the mini map. Okay. Now I want 
want the fish. Where's my sharky? Shark. Chompins! Okay. Uh, Strangula. Make that easy. And purple rupees. You know, I still only have one, one rupee. I know I can do it. There we go. Now, whether or not that's what I was supposed to do, gonna be a whole new other thing. Uh, Fire Wizard. Doing the exact same thing, so Ignizol. You also produce a much brighter flame. Okay. Okay, so with enough torches lit, it does give us access. Okay. Buzz blob. Ouch. Buzz blob. Buzz blob. Get it now. Boom, boop, 
Boop, boop. Go. Okay, this is a key. Oh, that's mean. Oh, I think I can deal with that room. This is... really good and confusing. Okay. So we've just learned that these aren't weighted as in they'll just keep going. They're weighted as in you have to keep putting things on to make it work. Where's rock? There we go. Key. Third key. Okay. Let's head back down where we were. Because there was another room this way. Oh! Okay. We found the boss room. Which is awesome. But not where we're trying to go. There's a door there. Hmm. There's a whole other space we have not been to. Let's go check that out. I'm gonna be all over the place exploring this dungeon. This is definitely one of the better dungeons. For sure. You're hilarious, Bemos. Okay. So what I want is to summon my electric keys. Then we go up. So what's this way? It's the dungeon map! Thank goodness. Okay. So that floor is all dealt with. Huh. 
Okay. We have three keys. Let's go check this out. No! Manhandla. Oh boy. Okay, so fire definitely will be my best friend. And Manhandla's worst enemy. Wait, where are you going? Oh, it's gonna be one of those. I was wondering about that. Does that mean Manhandla is gonna be the boss? Okay. How do I get down there? Over here. Water. After. Okay. Uh, up we go. So let's put rocks down. Rock and rock. And then I do water blocks to go up from below. Okay. So we already know I want fire. Actually, no, we did quite a bit of damage with this guy. Hello, Manhandla. Okay. Let's destroy the frog. Nope, let me out. Spawn. Okay. Oh. No, I'm grabbing that. Yep. 
there. Okay. That wilted the flower. But that means that manhandler isn't the boss. Well, there goes that idea. Also, I'm still missing that. How did I get there? I got there. How did I get there? I know I could just go into the boss, but there is still a chest and a space I have not explored. How did I get here? Game. Reveal to me my own secrets. Okay. Uh huh. Oh. The other locked door. The one that's this way. And this way. Open. So, what's the big reveal? Golden egg. So yeah, definitely a Misery Mire Temple. Because we didn't really need to go explore the whole dungeon again. To make it here. We just needed two keys. Still not as bad as Jabul Waters where you could have skipped the entire dungeon. Okay. Oh, boy. Boy! Hi! Yeah, we kind of said it was going to be a Goma. Okay, so what I need to do is... Oh gosh, would the bats actually be faster? Get up there. Monkeys. There. Okay. Now, I think I want to spawn in the Dark Nut level 3. Oh boy. Okay. Spawn in a whiz robe. Okay, whiz robe. Way faster at attacking.
Okay. Uh, we're not going to make the same mistake with the electric keys again. And kill your own babies! Okay. Uh, fire. Okay, now electric riz uh, electric riz whiz rope. We kind of have a system going for Goma. Okay, and then choppy choppies. Okay. There we go. We've cleared out this evil Goma. Does that mean that the Deku scrubs have been in fact eating Goma's babies? Ooh, I don't like the implications of this. Because there's so much that could have been interpreted. It's okay. It's okay. The misery mire of Echoes of Wisdom has been accomplished and completed. It's probably my favorite temple so far. Okay, try. My friend shared some of their power with me. Now he's level 10. I feel like I can do even more now. Costs have gone down. Ooh, I can summon two red Lizalfoses. That's awesome. And we got more crystals. Five more. You know what? This is fitting because Pharaoh's kind of like the silly. The silly of the goddesses. Priestess. Ferore, not Pharaoh. Your courage has freed this land which was swallowed by nothingness. I am the goddess Ferore, one of the three who created your world. You have demonstrated true courage. Thus, I grant my sanction unto you. You got Ferrari's sanction. I always feel like I'm pronouncing it wrong. Priestess. We three have borne witness to your true nature. Now, to open the path to the prime energy, go to the ancient forest guarded by the sacred tree. There you may also encounter the hero you seek. Remember this, your courage will one day be your salvation. Hmm, cute. We've gotten all the sanctions. Now we go to the ancient forest guarded by the sacred tree. And Link will be there too. There's nothing really for us to do in the still world for now. Let's go back to your world. And we got the heart container. 
So let's hop on out. Let's go. And we'll talk to the Dekus. The Deku Scrubs. Well, that was awful. Yep, I've had it with spiders and dark thorns. Good riddance to all of it. I'm just glad everyone's back. Thank you for saving them. Hmm? What is it? I think... I think I smell something. Yeah, I smell it too. It's light and fresh and fruity. What is that? I know what it is. I know exactly what it is. We were so hung up on cotton candy, we didn't see it under our snoots this whole time. A treat that tastes great and puts a refreshing feeling in your mouth. Y you mean... Yep! Smoothies! The fact that we smell them all the way from here must mean everyone's drinking them. Ah, we can't be the last ones to try them. We all look like bumpkins. Come on, let's go. Oh my goodness. Deku Scrubs have now increased my love for them. Always after the next thing. Guess they didn't learn much from the cotton candy incident. They were eating spider webs. Tried. They were eating spider webs. <laughs> Off they go. Look at him. His business is booming even more. Bow. I don't really understand Deku Scrubs, but as long as they're happy, I suppose it's fine. Well, I'm glad we fixed the Pharaon Wetlands Rift and we got the sanction from the goddess Ferore. Zelda? The ancient forest the goddesses mentioned. I don't know where that is. Maybe your father knows? Long have I awaited this moment. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Zelda! It better be in my clothes. That's not how I look like. Ooh, listen to that Zelda lullaby, though. It's, like, all twisted and gnarled. The goddesses have provided their sanctions, so I should be able to approach the prime energy. Yes, this identity should suffice. Zelda! Interesting. Where's he taking us? Oh, back to the castle. The king and Impa are like, what is she wearing? Ooh. Ah, Zelda, you're awake. I'm going to be hopping out of these outfits after this. After you collapsed, Tri brought you here to the castle. We've been watching over you, waiting for you to wake up. But what has happened? And we fill them in. I see. The goddesses spoke of an ancient forest with this sacred tree. Impa, do you know anything about this? Mm, yes, yes, it must be the eternal forest. 
As for the sacred tree, well, that must be the beautiful large tree located there. So it's the forest northwest of here. The trees are dense, to nav so navigating it will prove challenging. Hey, Zelda? Null must have been planning this from the start. They waited until you earned the right to seek the prime energy, then created an echo of you. That's why they imprisoned the goddesses in the rifts to lure us in and advance their plan. If only I'd realized this sooner. Well, this is rather discouraging, isn't it? Discouraging? Oh, you mean this feeling, discovering Null's plan so late. Yeah, I feel very discouraged. Null might end up obtaining the prime energy. If that happens, our best chance will be to join forces with Link. The goddesses shared that if you go to the Eternal Forest, you may find our hero Link. Zelda, as your father, the truth is that I want you to remain here. It pains me to consider you stepping out into danger once again. But I know, but now I understand. You are the priestess of wisdom. As king, I must ask for your help. Please go to the Eternal Forest. Find the hero and put an end to Null's nefarious plans. Nefarious! Please, priestess, save Hyrule. Do, 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 do. Okay. Well, before we get to that, let's get out of that ridiculous outfit. Uh, let's go back to the original. We haven't been in this one for a long time. Oh. Oh, that's why. Princess! Phew, what a relief to see you safe. I was so worried when I heard you were attacked. I've been waiting outside nervously, awaiting any news from the King and Lady Impa. You... You're not leaving again, are you? Are you? Yes, we're leaving. We're going to the Eternal Forest. Oh, the Eternal Forest, you say? Well then, allow me to ensure that the Eternal Forest is safe for passage. If I leave everything to you, then I won't be worthy of my office. Please, I insist. Right then, with that, I'm off. That's why I wouldn't let us warp. He needed to go first. Uh, oh. We didn't have a chance to tell right the important part that Null made an echo of you. Oh, that's going to be very bad for us. Okay, there we go. So, thank you guys so much for joining me in this episode of The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. In the next episode, we're not going to the forest yet. We're going to return back to Faron Wetlands to see if we have any side quests. And if we were to take a look if there are any other remaining pieces of heart there uh, because we are in fact missing how many pieces there's three left in the game and the fact that there's only two marked in that specific location is concerning and then there's still some more might crystals for us to find because there are 10 left in the game. So we're going to see if we can find any more might crystals. Which honestly might actually be up there. So who knows. With that guys we're going to call it an episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked today's episode please leave a comment in the comment section below. Mash the like button and subscribe if you have not for more Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom content. We will see you all next time. The Res Plays is out.